Welcome in and namaste, greetings divine, infinite light beings, so good to be back, so good to have you back, Ashe, Ashe, um, I was, you know, touching bases with my babies, Ashe, and some very interesting, some very powerful, some very, um, important cards came out, Ashe, confirmation with the stupid commercials, fuck, fuck. Um, yeah, it's, it's 3.38 in the a.m., Ashe, and, um, energies is just all on me, Ashe, so I decided to, you know, see what, um, we could get out of this, you know, I was divinely guided to see what we can get out of, um, these cards, you know, I just asked the cards, um, as the confirmation, what do we need to know, Ashe? And the first card that came out was the Four of Wands. So this is a divine counterpart that wants you to know um, something, Ashe. Um, or this is you very stable in this moment, Ashe. Then we also had the Ace of Cups, you know, come out. So, But that's a new cup of love, Ashe, given to you by the divine hand, Ashe, by the divine creator, creator, by your um, spirit guides, your supernatural spiritual love war team, Ashe, is looking over on you, Ashe, with this new cup of um, love, compassion, Ashe, because you're a very stable, grounded individual, Ashe, and um, a loving, very stable, grounded individual wants to offer you this cup of love, I, I believe, Ashe, I believe that you are the Nine of Pentacles, and there is this King of Cups that wants to come in and offer you a stable foundation, Ashe, your divine counterpart. You don't have to be um, a water sign or earth sign to be in this Nine of Pentacles, and to, or for someone to be in this King of Cups, Ashe. Um, energy has no gender, Ashe, these messages are always timeless, past, present, and future, Ashe, um, but remember, Ashe, always acknowledge, Ashe, the spirit insists that we dwell in the present energy, Ashe, so we could live a, a, a fruitful, abundant life in the present energy, Ashe, and so, if the messages don't resonate with you, just just leave them on the table, you know, just overlook them, just, you know, let them go in one ear and out the other, Ashe, because they truly weren't meant for you, Ashe, Ashe, and, um, I sound like this because there's a lot of energies on me at this time, Ashe, it's a lot of energies that I'm, um, combating through to make sure that I stay stable within my energy, Ashe. And so, I may sound funny, um, <clears throat> but that is the reason why, I say, earth, air, fire, water, ether, drive away all harm, negative energy, only good may enter and dwell here in perfect positivity, in my scarred and sacred space, it is so, so it is, and so won't it be, I say, I say. Pure hands, pure heart, pure thoughts, pure intentions to come over to me. I pray the moment as I be the vessel for the channel messages for the massive energy, feminine energy, masculine energy, masculine energy, and feminine energy at this present time. I invoke um, in and um, request that our supernatural love war team assist us in this um, present time to hover over us and to keep us um, comforted, to keep us safe, to keep us protected, and to keep our minds um, with a focus, um, to be focused, I say, to be um, clear and accurate, I say, within this present moment, I say, and I give thanks and I give gratitude for that, I say, I say, and I welcome in the entire supernatural love war team as I welcome in the archangels, the dark angels, and the light angels, I say, um, to bring
bring forth their power. Hashem to bring forth their knowledge, their love, and their wisdom. Hashem in this present moment, and I give gratitude. Hashem, Hashem, and so, um, and when I looked at the bottom of the cup, I seen the star. Hashem, so the star is indicating that this person feels like you are a star. Hashem, you could be a star. You could be getting ready to be a star. It could be in your birthright, in your charts, to be a star. Hashem. Yeah, um, someone sees you as a star, Ashe. Um, they have hope in this relationship. They have hope in this connection, Ashe. They have hope in the future between you and them, Ashe. Um, you know, they feel like this is, uh, you know, uh, a good feeling from spirit. And it is, because here it is right here. Here's the confirmation. The cup of hemp, the cup of love given to you by spirit, Ashe, and this person feels this, Ashe, and so, you know, um, let's see what else this person has to say, or what else this person wants to say, Ashe, or what does the collective need to know, Ashe, divine spirit, with the massive energy, feminine and masculine energy, what do we, the feminine and masculine energy need to know at this time, thank you, spirit, Ashe, I thank you for Allow me to be the vessel in this present moment, I say. Yeah, the Queen of Pentacles, I say. The Queen of Pentacles. So they see you as a nurturing, um, stable, stable, um, independent person, I say. You know, a working, a hard-working parent, I say. Making things right for your children. Making things right for your home. Making things right for you, I say. And, and this person sees this. This King of Cups or this Queen of Cups. They see how stable you are. They see how loving and nurturing you are. They have felt this energy within you. They have seen this energy within you, I say. And this is why they feel like... Um, this is a divinely given connection from, you know, spirit. They feel like they can, you know, move forward with you, Ashe. Um, bringing, bringing painful endings to an end to, to, to move forward with you, Ashe. Leaving behind betrayal and, and deep wounds, Ashe, to, you know, to move forward with you, Ashe. Um, yeah. To move forward with you, Ashe. Wanting to come in, you know. Ambitious about this new beginning with you, Ashe. Ambitious about taking action, Ashe. Um, driven to make this, 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 this relationship successful. Look. <laughs> driven to make this this relationship successful. This is two um, major arcanas, I say. The page of, the page of, um, the page. So, the page has something to do with this. I say they could be younger than you. I say you could be older than them. But this Ace of Cups, I say. This Ace of Pentacles, I say. That's spirit. That's divinely guided, I say. Clarify this nine of pinnacles. Ugh. We have the hair five. I don't know where that card came from, but we're going to keep it. And we have, um, One second. Excuse me. So, with all the interruptions that we didn't have in just this little bit of time, somebody doesn't want this relationship. Just point blank, period. Um, somebody doesn't want this relationship. But this this King of Cups sees um, uh, uh, a future with you. Sees uh, 
um, a long um, loving relationship with you. Um, see a spiritual connection with you. This is this hair farm is landing right on top of um, this Nine of Pentacles. Sees you traditional as well as they are traditional. And wherever this King of Cups is right now is not happy. So they could be going, um, this King of Cups could be um, separating from a relationship. Ashe um, getting a, a divorce from a relationship because um, this is um, the the king the ten of cups in reverse so whatever they were dealing with before um you their dreams were shattered i say it didn't it didn't it wasn't successful it wasn't happy it wasn't loving it wasn't um it was a disconnect i say there was no values there was a struggled relationship that they were going through i say and so um yeah spirit said look at the yeah, they were burdened by this relationship that they are coming up out of or have came up out of, Ashe. Thank you, Spirit. So this could be, um, but I don't see, I'm seeing this, this king, Queen of Pentacles being you as well, Ashe. Yeah, them wanting to make an offer to this Queen of Pentacles, Ashe, which is you as well. Or King of Pentacles, with the, with the, which is you. Um, very romantic, very charming, Ashe. Very um, heartfelt, you know, offer with this Knight of Cups, Ashe. This is um, the slowest um, offer in in this, in this the tarot, but it's a, a stable offer. It's a real offer. It's a promising offer, Ashe. Um, and here we have the Knight of Wands, Ashe. So... This could be someone else, Ashe. Um, or they could just be very energetic and passionate about this offer that they want to give to you, Ashe. What else, Spirit? Yeah, very passionate. You know, so this could be, you know, a new offer. Uh, well, of course, if this, this King of Cups is coming out of a relationship... This is a new offer, or this could be, um, someone you've been back and forth off and on with, Ashe. Doesn't have to be a new offer, Ashe. It could be someone you, you know, was back and forth off and on with, Ashe. Um, someone that you was trying to get to know. Ashe, or someone that you were in a relationship before, they left you to, you know, be with someone else. It didn't work out, and they're coming back. Ashe, take the messages as they resonate for you, Ashe. Yeah, well, here we have the Page of Pentacles, Ashe. <coughs> Clarify this Ace of Pentacles. Thank you, Divine Spirit. We have this Knight. Knight of um, Wands, once again, clarify this Eight of Pentacles. I mean, this Ace of Pentacles. Thank you, Spirit. This Ace of Pentacles. Yeah, they want a give and take relationship. And they see that with you, Ashe. They see that they could have, you know, a sharing, loving um, relationship. Um, someone as, as generous as they are, Ashe. Someone who is um, is willing to share true love such as they are, Ashe. This is landing on top of the, 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 the ultimate gift of love. Plus the ultimate gift of foundation and st stability right on top of the Six of Pentacles, Ashe. And then we have the Ten of Pentacles landing right on top of, this is what they want with you. Didn't Spirit say um, a long-term relationship? Ten of Pentacles, happiness, love, wealth, financial stability, family. Just um, long-term success, Ashe. Just a stable ground with this Four of Wands. That's why Spirit said in the beginning, this is your divine counterpart, Ashe. Yeah. Um, but it's always some conflict and some, you know, sneakiness 
you know, lurking about, I say always. But then Spirit just say somebody within the, the um, interruption of the videos, somebody didn't want this for the, the both of you. So we already had confirmation about that, I say. Clarify this Ten of Cups in reverse. Thank you, Spirit. Yeah, this person. Oh, this person is feeling um, disconnect, boredom with um, wherever they're at right now because they're not with you. And we've seen that with the Ten of Cups in reverse, I say. Um, so they're, they could be very emotional too, I say, because they're not happy where they are right now. They're in a, a strained relationship, I say, or are coming out of a strained relationship or trying to disconnect from a strained relationship as they are trying to, wanting to come and offer you something, I say, you, look, the happiest um, energy in the fucking tarot card um, suit, I say, the sun, they see you as the sun, they see you as bliss, happiness, healing, love, joy, abundance, prosperity, I say, and they want to come to you, this is right in between the, the, um, the queen of pentacles, they see you as stable, nurturing, happiness, love, bliss, this is what they want, this is what, why they want to bring this offer to you, I say, They see po positivity in you. They see motivation in you. So you could have motivated this person to even, you know, disconnect from this relationship. This estranged relationship, I say. This abusive relationship. This neglecting relationship. This, you know, um, this challenging, burdening relationship. Because we've seen that, you know, two of pentacles. Two of Pentacles. So somebody's trying to balance the situation, I say. But yeah, they see vitality with you. They see you, you know, you give them fun, you give them joy. You you bring a sense of warmth to them, I say. Um, you make them feel like this relationship could be successful. And you make everything feel like all is well, I say. Thank you, Spirit. But we see that with this Two of Cups. They want this new partnership. And they want it fast, Ashe. With this Knight of um, Swords, Ashe. Yeah, look. We have a, all these fucking major arcana cards. This is nothing but Divine Spirit in the mix of this, Ashe. The Temperance card, they see you as being this Earth Angel. They see you as being balanced. But we've seen that with the Four of Wands. We've seen that with the Queen of Pentacles. We've seen that with the, the Nine of Pentacles, Ashe. Very balanced is how they see you, Ashe. Um, they see you have a purpose in life, Ashe. They see you, you find meaning in life, Ashe. And they feel your spiritual attributes they they feel your spiritual connection they feel a spiritual connection to you i say this is landing right on top of the two of cups so they know this is divinely given i say they know this is divinely ordered they know that this is not a coincidence they know that this is you know some kind of synchronicity from spirit i say thank you spirit why is the six of pentacles here why is the six of pentacles here thank you spirit yeah, they want this new beginning with you, this death card. They've had a, a, a realization, a transformation, I say, and they want this new beginning with you. That's why Spirit said you could have, you know, this could have been someone you dealt with before, I say, and you walked away from them, I say, and now they want to come back because, you know, you, you brought death, but they want a new beginning, I say. Take the messages as they resonate for you, I say. Or it could just be someone wanting to, you know, give you a new offer of love, Ashe. Or take the messages as they resonate. 
could be somebody wanting to reconnect, re rekindle, I say, because the grass wasn't greener on the other side as they thought it was going to be, I say. Yeah, they see you as wish fulfillment off top. They see you as their fantasy coming true. They see you as this love they never thought existed. They see you as um just the ultimate happiness, Ashe. A wish, uh, like, you know, they, they blew out every, they see you as every time they, they birthday came and they made that wish, they wish for you, Ashe. And no matter how old they are now, they finally get their fucking wish, Ashe. Because each year when they blew that candle out on their birthday, they made this wish for you. They manifested this true love in their life and it was you. And they finally got it, Ashe. So somebody's birthday could be coming up, Ashe. As we speaking about birthdays, or somebody could just have had a birthday, Ashe, but they want to collaborate with you. They want to work with you. This could be a work dynamic, Ashe. It doesn't have to be, Ashe, but this is the three of pentacles. Somebody wants to collaborate with you, Ashe. Yeah, somebody want to move forward. Major Arcana, another Major Arcana. This is a Cancer, Ashe. I see 69. I say somebody wants to um, just make progress with this relationship. Look, Nine of Pentacles, the Hierophant, a long-lasting relationship, Ten of Pentacles. I say moving forward with the chariot, with the spiritual pushing this relationship through. I say pushing this relationship um, to get started. I say pushing this relationship to be everlasting and long, um, you know, long-lasting, you know, um, and somebody is in their head about this, Ashe. Somebody is in their head about this. Having a lot of depression and anxiety. So this could be your counterpart or this could be the person that don't want the relationship to happen, Ashe. Because we, this is the third time. We got the five of swords and we also um, had that interruption. Now we see this card, Ashe. So this could be your divine counterpart in their head about wanting to get to you, wanting to be with you, wanting to leave this other relationship in the dust. Or this could be someone um, seeing that you're moving on, someone else seeing that you're moving on and it's, it's bothering them, it's hurting them, it's, 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 um, it's, it's ill in them, Ashe. Yeah. But here we have the um the page of cups they want to come in and give you this message i say um they have a happy surprise for you i say but this 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 um this fish in the cup is you know that is very abundant very abundant new love they want this new love they want this new love they want the point blank period they want this new love with you divine infinite light being it's, it's they they've been contemplating they didn't went inside they didn't they didn't have their spiritual awakening about this they didn't you know um overcame some shit about this they didn't you know weigh their options and shit about this and this is landing right on top of um the sun card, I say, um, they don't mind carrying whatever burden. I say, they've had a spiritual awakening about this. They're willing to go the bat for this relationship. They see that um, it's worth it, I say. The hard work, to put in hard work, um, to be um, um, complete, to have a completion, I say. They see um, that it's going to take, ooh, my stomach confirmation. They see that it, it is going to take, you know, some some hard work, Ashe, but they see that it's, you know, they're willing to put in this hard work, Ashe. Um, like, again, Spirit said, you know, it could be somebody that you separated with, so somebody wanting to come out of the cold, Ashe. Somebody wanting to get back in your good graces, Ashe. Take the messages as they resonate for you. Or this could be the person that um, 
does not want you in this relationship having a lot of financial loss i say just um lacking you know their mindset you know we're seeing them in that nine of swords energy so this is someone that you know is um discontent because you are not with them i say or they can't get back into your energy. This, this, I, I'm not feeling like this is um, your divine counterpart. I'm feeling like this is another energy that wants to come out of the cold. Take the messages as they resonate. It could be a lover. It could be a family member. It could be a platonic friend or a co-worker, a child. Somebody wants to come out of the cold. Um... And they're having a lot of financial fucking issues, you know, um, a lot of worry, um, a lot of poverty, insecurity. I say, thank you, spirit. Clarify this temperance card. Why is the temperance card here? We have the sun again. But these people see nothing but happiness in you. Nothing but uh, purity in you. Nothing but, because you see how she's naked? Um, nothing but, you know... Um, pure um, innocence in you, pure hope, calm. They see you as always being calm. They see you as always being renewed, Ashe, and, and staying in your spirituality. They see this in you as you shine, divine, infinite light beings. I'm a little spark of light. We are the divine creator's infinite light beings. Together we come to, we come together to communion. Ashe, to communion, to love, to heal, to inspire, to uplift, to motivate one another, Ashe, and this is what we are, we are the star energy on this planet, in this earth realm, Ashe, and this is how they see you, Ashe, the people that you are disconnected from, they want to get back into your energy, and, and your divine counterpart also sees you as this as well, Ashe. Judgment. So we have the judgment card out here. I say a new phase in life. A new phase in life is coming to you by the divine hand of spirit. I say, look, we have always with that conflict. Always with that conflict. So somebody is working hard to get to you. I say, somebody is willing to. Be diligent and passionate for this relationship. This Eight of Pentacles is right on top of the Four of Wands, the Knight of uh, of um, the Knight of Swords, the Two of Cups, the Temperance. Ashe, trying to have patience, trying to have, be grounded. Ashe, trying to um, just be be stable. Ashe, and having moderation. As they try to get to you, Ashe, this Knight of Pen this Page of Pentacles, right on top of this wish fulfillment. But something this is holding them back with this chariot. Competition, rivalry, conflict, disagreement, strife, tension. So it could be a lot of tension with trying to get to you, Ashe. But it's destined. This is destined. They can't stop your destiny. They can't stop this connection. Ashe. This is good luck. This is meant to be. This is a, the turning point of this relationship. Ashe. So that this King of Cups want to come in with some honesty. With some honesty. Yeah. Moving away from this energy, Ashe. Releasing from limited beliefs, you know. Um, detaching. Breaking free from this relationship. It doesn't have to be. Uh, um, a relationship 
with another person or uh, um, it doesn't have to be a love relationship it doesn't have to be it could be a relationship you know breaking free from um, spending so much time at work breaking free from spending so much time with their kids breaking free from spending so much time with um, toxic behaviors breaking free I say from limiting beliefs it could be a thought that's holding them back from we seen that with the five of swords um, from coming towards you but um, they're breaking free from this I say they're breaking free from the burden of what's keeping y'all separate I say yeah they they come to this conclusion that they want to break free from whatever's keeping y'all separate I say because they, they, they're missing out every day that they're not with you. They're missing out on the happiness, the memories that they could be making with you. I say is what I heard. I say they, they feel like time is being wasted is what I heard. I say um, when they could be spending and making precious memories with you. I say, yeah. They're ready to take this leap of faith. They're ready to step out on the innocence. The spirits say um, they see you with um, in pure innocence. I say with um, my clock is wrong. I say, but <laughs> um, yeah, eleven on the clock. It's one ten, but that is not right. I say with one twenty two. I said, see, one, 122, I say, they, they want a honeymoon, they want a marriage, they want a commitment, they want something that they never had, remember, Spirit said they've been wishing for this, every, every time they blow out that candle, every time they get a wish, remember, they only get one wish, and every time they get that one wish, it's the same wish, and they've been manifesting true love has been their wish, I say. They want to make an effort, I say. They want to make an effort. Yeah, they want to have a heart-to-heart -heart conversation. And here we have again, make an effort. And then spirits say they want to give you a message with this um, page of cups. With They want to tell you how much they love you, I say. With um, one, one, one on the clock, I say. They see nothing but chemistry between the two of you. Just as well as you see nothing but chemistry. I say they want to retreat. They want to take you on a romantic um, getaway. They want to, you know, just spend some quality time with you. They just want to spend some peaceful time with you. Some loving time with you. I say that's what they really want. I say they, um... They paid attention to all the red flags, I say, just as well as you paid attention to all the red flags. They they know that they won't receive any red flags with you, I say. They have not received, they have not seen any red flags with you, I say. Um, and they're keeping an open mind. They want you to keep an open mind, I say. They want you to keep an open mind. They need you to keep an open mind, I say. They don't want any negative thoughts to seep into your head, I say. Um, it, it is safe to love, I say. It's safe to love. It's safe for you to love. It says, open your heart to give and receive the biggest energy of all. So, and this, I, I put that right on top of, um, I put that right on top of the Six of Pentacles. This right on top, it's landing right on top of the six of pentacles. Give and receive. I say they see nothing but attraction. I say, um, and like Spirit said, you could be separated from this person as well. I say, so this could be somebody wanting to reconnect with you as well. I say, express your love. They want to come in. The spirits say they want to come in and they want to give you a message about how much they love you. And here we have engagement. Ashe, and here we have, we see separation again. Somebody does not want to be separated from you. Ashe. Uh, yeah, stay optimistic about your love life. Ashe, think positive. 
bring it in because you know what you deserve love and spirit is telling you you deserve love and this is landing right on top of this hair fire landing right on top of this nine of pentacles you have been in these relationships that have not been fulfilling when it comes to love and now spirit is saying you deserve love i say and this person this king of cups also um, knows that you are lovable and wants to give you love, Ashe. This is a past life relationship, Ashe. This is a past life relationship. And so, it is what it is. It's going to be what it's going to be. And y'all going to be together in one of these days, Ashe. Be patient. Have patience, Ashe. Um, just know that this is... Is working his way to you, Ashe, by the divine hand of spirit, Ashe. It's nothing but a lot of major arcanas in this reading, Ashe. It's nothing but a lot of um, promising love and um, commitment in this relationship, happiness and joy and peace in this relationship. Nothing will be toxic. It won't be have no kind of toxic energy in this relationship, Um this is very positive, Ashe. Very, very positive. And so I'm going to leave it on a positive note, Ashe. I'm sending love and healing energy out your way, Ashe, to each and every one of you. <laughs> to each and every one of you, I'm sending love and healing energy through the, from the ethers through me to you, Ashe. Ashe. And so um, I have an open heart, an open mind, an open hands to receive the warm energy of love and positivity and abundance. Ashe, I'm a little spark of light. Together we are the divine creators of infinite light. Beings. This has been um, beautiful, I would say, Ashe. Um, I, I, I wish you well. I wish you nothing but peace, bliss, and love within this relationship, Ashe, because this is um, divinely given by the hand of spirit and um if it belongs to you no one can stop it it will be yours i say it will show up and it will manifest in your life um just as it's supposed to because we are the divine creators infinite light beings the faithfuls and we are always divinely guided um securely um we are divinely guided infinitely provided for securely protected and highly loved by spirit, Ashe. And nothing is a coincidence. It is all synchronicities. And this is a past life relationship that is meant to be in this um, lifetime, in this earthly realm. And it will happen for you, divine infinite light beings. So just be positive and just think, um, just think positive and go on about your day as you go on about your day and know that your divine counterpart truly wants to be in this relationship and truly loves you and truly sees nothing but happiness and bliss within you and what y'all can have together ashe and what spirit wants y'all to have together this is divinely guided this is divinely orchestrated this is divinely ordained with so much major arcana not too much none no kind of negativity ashe is always going to be somebody that try to stop true love but that's all they can do is try they can't they won't succeed in stopping true love whatever spirit has for you whatever the divine creator has for you whatever your super spiritual um natural love war team has for you will be for you just know that and and and, and acknowledge that ashe ashe and so um I'm itching, so that is confirmation. Ashe, um, um, I'm sending my love to you, Ashe, wishing you nothing but peace, love, bliss, and happiness. Um, clear and accurate thoughts, Ashe, for your purpose down your path on your journey. Ashe, and so may the peace be in you as it is within me. Ashe, 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 Ashe. Happy love to you all, because this is beautiful, Ashe.